Well, here we are now at the Meyerveen home. Today is Saturday, September 10. Um, so, I don't even know. 12 days later, it's been a blur. But uh, there's been volunteers here around the clock, seems, most days, 9 to 5 with Mike. And we have quite a different view. We've gutted everything, holds up all the floors. <laughs> that used to be our new wallpaper. Uh, front hallway, front room. We had just gutted this when we moved in seven years ago. Gutting it again. But um, this time, taking out all the lath and plaster boards. Last time we had just shoved insulation between them. Our new living room. Oh, yes. And dining room area. All down to studs. We're finding that there are millions of nails in the floor and the layers of flooring that were there in 1860s home. That's, that's what happens. Kitchen. My <laughs> kitchen ready to use just kidding um, that was our bathroom downstairs bathroom and that was into our garage but hey new possibilities now we'll have a room off of our this garage never fit our cars anyway so now we can just have a make it into a part of the house and I always wanted a window out into the backyard there where near the door is so hey might as well right <laughs> so, anyway, house is looking quite different, but coming along. Dad keeps working on mucking out the basement. You can hear the generator going. We're getting power restored. Still mucking out the basement. Half of the foundation went into the cellar, so it was quite a mess down there. been quite a week. To the grace of God, the structural engineers say that the house can be saved. We can shore up the foundation. A lot, a lot of work yet to go, but a ton of work that's already happened, and can't say thank you enough to all the volunteers that have been here, especially all the other RCA pastors and colleagues. Hopefully upstairs we'll still be able to be okay, but we, we will see as we go. One day at a time, one step at a time. That's the update from the Meyerbeans.